Welcome to my Demon Souls Armor Guide series. In this series I will show you how to acquire all the armors that are listed as male armors in the Demon Souls wiki.wiki. Click the links or the annotations to skip to the part that you want to see. The Ancient King set is the only heavy set without stamina regeneration penalty. It is worn by Demigod and founder of Boletaria, Old King Doran, who got locked away into the family's mausoleum by the corrupted King Alant. You can only acquire it by killing him, and therefore you must enter the mausoleum. You can obtain the key for the mausoleum in two different ways. Either you follow Ostrava's questline by rescuing him in worlds 1-1, 1-2, And Or you can kill him at any point in the game. You can then make your way to the mausoleum. There are many ways to kill him, but since he has so many HP, the easiest and quickest way probably is to storm ruler him off a cliff. This is very tricky, so be patient.
Then, upon returning to the mausoleum and after quitting and reloading the game, his armor set, as well as the Eternal Warrior's ring, will show up in the mausoleum where you first encountered him. The venerable sage's set is worn by Sage Frey the Visionary. He is locked away in the prison cell in the Tower of Latria and serves as an advanced spell teacher in the Nexus after his rescue. There are two ways to acquire his armor set. The first and recommended method is to loot it from a prison cell in Latria in 3-1 by following the path shown in the video. To access the area, pure wide world tendency is required in the Tower of Latria. Or, you rescue him with a key in the room above the boss room in 3-1. I am a humble... I won't cause you trouble. Which you can use to open his cell in the tower. He will then return to the Nexus, where you can kill him. This way you will also get the baby snail and the ring of magical sharpness. Keep in mind though that killing him will turn your character tendency towards pure black and that you can acquire both the ring and the baby snail later on in the game. The saint's robes are worn by Saint Urbane, sworn enemy of Sage Freak the Visionary. The robes are fairly heavy, but do not serve as a good armor in comparison. There are two ways to acquire the set. The recommended method is to take it from the Valley of Defilement, World 5-1.
You can also get it by killing Urbane either in 4-2 or after his rescue, which is shown in the video, after his return to the Nexus. Souls driven you mad? This way you will also get the Ring of Devout Prior. Keep in mind though that killing him will turn your character tendency towards pure black and that you can acquire the ring later on in the game either by trading the large sword of moonlight with Sparkly the Crow or as a quest reward from Salem Vinland in 5-2. The Dark Silver Set can only be acquired once per playthrough. It is worn by Garl Vinland, brother to Salem Vinland and spouse to Maiden Astraya. It has the best magic resistance of all armors in the game, but is also one of the heaviest. You get it in the main Estrella boss fight in 5-3 by killing Garl in his attempt to protect his beloved Maiden Estrella. The Shaman's armor set can only be acquired once per playthrough as well. It is dropped by one of the Shamans in the Valley of Defilement in World 5-2. Thanks for watching, see you next guide!